Good afternoon guys, excuse the weird lighting, it's a strange time of day, well it's not strange but let me check, it is 3.45 so the sun's kind of low, or a little bit low, but yeah it's another nice day, it's not as nice as yesterday but it's still nice, I think that's, that marks a couple days in a row that has been decent weather which is surprising, so I'm happy about that. Uh, today nothing's going on, I thought my brothers would be coming over for dinner but apparently they're not, so what I'm going to do is nothing. I'm going to try to make videos because I don't have insanity today so I want to do something productive. It's my rest day and then tomorrow is the fit test and max interval circuit I think so it's like an hour and a half of working out. That's going to be crazy but it will be awesome at the same time. Uh, right now well, what I've been doing since I've woken up is just watching videos and stuff like that. Did a bit of laundry. Yeah today's going to be a good day. Um, the clouds are rolling in so the lighting isn't so weird anymore. Oh, it's still a bit sunny, but yeah, um, what else has happened in the last little while since I filmed? Nothing, really. Um, not much has changed. <laughs> yeah, so it's going to be just a pretty average day and I've got nothing else to talk about, so I'm just rambling, so I'm going to end the clip here. I feel extra tired today, so I suppose it's good I've got insanity rest day. Still haven't made any videos, haven't done anything productive, but um... Yeah, I just feel tired, so I'm probably just going to write today off as a bit of a all-around rest day. I just want to sleep really early, wake up early. Yeah, I feel so tired. The sky looks really beautiful right now. I'll show it to you. Look at the awesome clouds. It doesn't really come out properly on camera, but it looks really incredible in person. Yeah, I don't know what I feel like doing right now. I'm bored. I'm a combination of bored, restless, tired. That's never a good combination, but I will find something to do, I'm sure. Uh, I'm going to go find something to do now because I'm just too bored. <laughs> I have been so bored, but I finally found something to do. I'm watching the Geelong Hawthorne game on TV. I've been watching it for a little while now. And we're winning 51-24. to 24. Uh, We're about to get a goal. Go! Yeah! We just got a goal. That's awesome. So, it's now 24-57. to 57. We're doing so well. This is awesome. We're going really well this season. I'm loving it. Shattered that if we get into the grand final, I won't get to watch it. But at the same time, that would still be fantastic. And I would definitely watch a rerun the day I get home and just have a grand final party, a belated grand final party. That would be so amazing. I'm also watching this um, documentary, don't ask me why, about um, Green Berets in America. It's like the special forces something or other in the military. It's like... Um, uh, what is it? The Red Berets in France, maybe? I don't know. It's like special unit that, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. But either way, they have to, you know how regular army people do basic training? Well, this is like a really intense one. I think you have to have been in the army to apply for this. And then it's a really intense one for two weeks. And they try to mentally break them even more so than basic training. I find, um things like that really interesting especially when there's a mental element to it a, a like psychological element um, yeah because it's always good to learn not that you can really learn from this sort of thing but it's good to you know to learn about psychological breaking points and how to make yourself stronger psychologically and all that kind of stuff um, it's just interesting it's not necessarily I'm not watching it to learn anything but it's interesting and I am learning things for instance the Green Beret camp is in North Carolina I don't know why I'll ever need to know that information, but I learned it anyway. And I'm going to go back to watching the football now. It's awesome. Um, so tonight didn't turn out so bad after all. I was really bored um, and yeah, I was tired as well. But now that I'm actually doing something, because <laughs> I was just browsing between web pages, now that I'm actually focusing on something, I'm not so tired. And yeah, today's a good day. We're about to get another goal. Oh no, that sucks. Anyway, I'm going to go watch now. <laughs> I'm going to amend my earlier statement. People can try to join the Green Berets without having been in the army. So they can come off the streets and do the training if they get selected, I suppose. But um, I don't know how you would be fit enough, unless you're a professional athlete, just coming off the streets to be a Green Beret. <laughs> it's pretty crazy. There's a lot of vomiting. Um, it's intense. And I'm really enjoying it. It's just crazy. It's it's cool watching people push themselves to the limit. I suppose that's why sport is so prevalent in society and everyone loves it so much, or not everyone, but so many people love it because you're watching people push themselves to their limit and compete and it's very compelling and people like to see that. So yeah, it's really cool. I'm enjoying it so far. Um, 
It's crazy though. Oh. And I think insanity is hard. I'll think of this tomorrow when I'm doing my hour and a half workout and uh, maybe it won't be so bad. <laughs> This is officially insane. One of the candidates has worked out so crazily and just pushed himself to the limit so much that when one of the instruct instructors said to him, do you know where you are? His answer was, and I quote, hash browns. What the actual fuck? That's crazy. I don't usually swear in my vlogs. That's actually strange. I don't swear that much in real life, I don't think. But yeah, hash browns. <laughs> and then he's like, I'm just dizzy. That's really, really, really crazy, but I'm enjoying watching this so much. I have no idea how it happened, but we were a few goals in front, and now we're a few goals behind, and it's in the final quarter. So it's looking like we may not win, but there's still a chance. There's still 12 minutes left. We can do it. We've just got to pull it together. But they're playing kick to kick right now. If you watch AFL, you know what that means. But it's annoying. Ah! We need the ball. I don't like watching us lose, especially to Hawthorne, because my stepdad goes for Hawthorne. And they just marked in front of their goal, so they're probably going to kick another goal. This is not a good sign. My team lost. Geelong lost by 23 points. We didn't deserve to win. We didn't play well enough to win. Not enough heart. Not enough effort. That sucks. But oh well. I'm just really hoping we beat Chris's team at the end of next month, because he's going to it, and it'll be great if we win. For me and for Amy. <laughs> That will be funny. Anyway, uh, I'm probably not going to be up for too much longer. What's the time? It's 10 past 10 and I'm already really tired. I don't know why. I didn't even exercise today, but I'm really tired. So yeah, I'm probably going to go to bed soon. So the vlog will be ended quite shortly. It's been very boring today, but some days are just like that. And in less than two weeks time, I will be vlogging from America. So those three weeks of vlogs from America should be pretty awesome and they should make up for ones like this. <laughs> it's time for me to end this vlog here. I'm not going to go to bed just yet but I am going to edit this. I've already edited most of it and it's over seven minutes and considering it's a day where I've done nothing that is far too long. So yeah I might as well end it now. Tomorrow is my hour and a half workout so I am sort of looking forward to it but sort of dreading it but it should go fine I'm sure. Uh, nothing's happening tomorrow besides that. I would like to say I'm going to make videos, but I probably won't. And then nothing's happening at all of next week. I'm going to a house party with a bunch of my friends on s next Sunday. Other than that, nothing much is really happening. So we'll see, though. Stuff might come up. I don't know. But, yeah, thank you for watching. I really do appreciate it. Hope you're doing well. Take care, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.